Well, at the end of season two, you Mateo kind of has this come to Jesus moment and realizes that he does still have feelings for uh, for Jeff. So he makes a sort of like a hail mary. Is that what they they say in the sports world? A, a hail mary play, and decides to give him a call and profess his love. And uh, you know, um, but he doesn't know if uh, if you, know, you it's kind of like a cliffhanger. We don't know if Jeff heard that message or not. So that's uh, when we get into the first episode of season three. There's been a lot of really great moments. Uh, I especially liked, uh, I, I did like uh, working on the episode where um, Jeff and I broke up, Jeff and Mateo rather, uh, Jeff and Mateo broke up. Um, you know, it was really fun. America uh, directed that episode. and It was really fun to sort of see her in her director's hat. And, um, you know, we really, it was that trust sort of established with her already because she knows the show so well and she knows all the characters so well. So, you know, I had to do, you know, my background was in comedy and uh, I had to do some, some dramatic moments in that episode. And uh, having America sort of like be the director and sort of guide you to that was a really... I mean, great experience for, for me and the rest of the cast, so it was amazing. Mateo's been, let's say, still wondering about his status with, uh, with Jeff and how the, he's kind of unsure about where they left things. Um, you know, in the last two months, he's probably out there like still looking for a job or probably the three jobs that he works. Mateo's a hustler, so, you know, but he can't lose this job. Mateo loves this job, so. This coming season, you know, Mateo's still dealing with his whole undocumented status, and we're going to really sort of delve into that some more. Um, also, the fact that his boyfriend, who is also his boss, is now his ex-boyfriend. So the whole tension of, you know, working uh, with your ex is going to be explored as well. You know, this is why you shouldn't date in the workplace, I guess. So it gets messy and complicated. So... Um, I'm really excited to sort of like delve into that um, storyline actually because I don't know. I think uh, Mateo, when uh, when you're not on Mateo's good side, it's just uh, yeah, hell hath no fury, like a Mateo scorned. It's so great to be back. Um, you know, I will say it's different this time. Like uh, the break between season one and season two was longer. So when we when we got back to season two, it really felt like a long break. And I was like, oh my god, Miss Ed. But and and going to season three, like we were gone. Our, my, our hiatus break was like four months, but it seems like we were only gone for like two days. It was like we're right back into the swing of things. It's great to see everybody. It's we really are one big happy family. It's just disgusting how much we get along and love each other. Um, but yeah, it's, it's just great to be finally back with your, with your family.